probably because of uh, uh, maybe Game Boy limitations, but like, that's so funny. funny that she's still in fucking. Yeah, prison. she's still in the fucking detention center, like 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 with the camera and everything. And I, I'm the one fucking arrested. What? You mean you? That's right. I killed your sister. It was me, Dio. <laughs> I explained what had happened to Maya. I basically told her, yeah, I killed her. So but what? We, but we went to a hotel literally right next. I did it for the vine. <laughs> <laughs> I did it for the vine! Wait, where's my controller? <laughs> okay, here it is. Alright, hello. Welcome back. Ace Attorney. Uh, I, I've actually been wanting to play this game. But since we have multiple games to play, we have to switch over every now and then. And but... the schedules are fucked up between each other. Yeah. Alright, and... so where the fuck were we? Uh. <laughs> right, we just completely cut off his line. Wait, what did we do? Wait, what were we doing? Uh, because uh, right now you went back to talk to well, to White, and right now he just called the cops on you. Oh. You're gonna get arrested right now. Oh, that's right. Oh yeah. And then remember to make the joke up, and then we just cut it off right there. <laughs> I don't remember, bro. Holy shit, that's. <laughs> ah, butts, Harry butts. <laughs> yeah. <here. laughs> right, actually, Phoenix, right, and my friend's name is Larry. Oh, right. Sorry, Pam. Puss was a murderer, right? Detective Gumshoe. I present to you the man who killed Miss Mia Fey. Oh, what? <laughs> Take this despicable human being into custody. I don't know why space, human, and being, but that's fantastic cuculus. What the fuck did he say? I don't fucking remember what he said. Close enough, I don't care. Uh, yeah, just... As if I'm going to try to correct you into the words he's trying to say. <laughs> <laughs> Farewell, Mr. Wrong. September 8th, 3.37 p.m. Detention Center? Yep. I can't believe it's only been a day since the first trial. My trial begins tomorrow. White's going to set a trap for me. And the prosecution will be on it, of course. Edgeworth included. <laughs> an attorney was assigned to me by the state yesterday. I refused. I had an idea. Oh. Right! Mr. Roy! Oh, Maya. Great. They let you out of detention. I'm not in fucking high school! <laughs> you stupid... Uh, just now, yes, it's all thanks to you. Ha. Huh. Now I'm afraid we switch places. Which I find kind of funny how they didn't really change the art for the background. I know! Probably probably because of uh, uh, maybe Game Boy limitations, but like... That's so funny, funny that she's still in fucking... Yeah, prison. she's still in the fucking detention center. Like, like, like with the camera and everything, and I I'm the one fucking arrested. What? You mean you? That's right. I killed your sister. It was me, Dio. <laughs> I explained what had happened to Maya. I basically told her, yeah, I killed her. So but, what? But we went to a hotel literally right next. I did it for the vine. <laughs> <laughs> I did it for the vine. Oh. It was just a prank, bro. <laughs> hey, calm down. Hey. The prank. <laughs> the prank? <laughs> it's just a prank, bro. The prank. <laughs> I don't believe it. How many people does that man need to destroy before he's satisfied? My mother, my sister, and now you. This has gone too far. You want to talk to your sister? Uh, the, the, I don't know. That's so random. Mr. Wright, please tell me. Is there anything I can do? I mean, technically she can, but she, she would just need a better uh, training for it. What do you mean by that? Oh, whoops, hold on. Hold on. I'm just, I'm just... There's a spirit medium. What do you think I'm trying to say? Oh, uh, no, no. <laughs> okay, hold on. Just uh, like how her mother defend me in court, help me break out of here? Just like how her mother did. Uh... Defend me in court! Or she'd be in court, actually. Yeah, actually, that's better. Because I refuse. I'm gonna defend myself. Which is usually not recommended if you're not a lawyer. <laughs> because if you don't know the law, then you're fucked, basically. Yeah. Well, you could cheer me on, che cheer for me in court. Cheer for you? You mean like a cheerleader? Does that mean I have to wear the whole outfit? No. What the <laughs> God, fuck? No. No. Don't do that. <laughs> God no. <laughs> you have to be formal in a court. What the fuck are you talking? Huh? Um. Yeah, like that. 
all right, leave it to me. It literally shows up in a fucking trailer outfit. You're like, this is not what I meant. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I am cooked. This is my lawyer. It's just like the cheerleader outfit. Fucking... Huh? I better go get you. God damn it. I literally called it. How did I do that? Hold on. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I... <laughs> it's kind of a weird coincidence. Wait, 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 wait. If you pick lawyer, she's like, uh, I'm gonna go, I think she's like study up on lawyer stuff. It's like, wait a minute, I was just joking. <laughs> I was just joking. Don't, dude, it's gonna take you years to read all those books. I'm just saying. What, what, what? I'm kidding. It was a joke. Yeah, right, that No part. way. No, really, I was kidding, but thanks. It's good to know you're on my side. And there really isn't anything you can do for me anyway. But, but I can't just sit here and do nothing. I've got to give that man a piece of my mind. Boop. <laughs> just gives her like, she like splits the brain like how you like split a cookie with like your brother yeah. or something. It's like here you go. He's <laughs> like pulsating in his hand. <laughs> just like what the hell is this? My mind, and I'm giving you a piece of it. What the fuck? Just a piece? Okay. <laughs> this is gross. They, just, to me. <laughs> they come to the trial tomorrow. Okay, I'll be there. I'm gonna watch you get arrested. I'll show them a thing or two. Yeah, I just realized the bit I just, the joke I just said, I just realized I know I just called her Mia, even, even though it's supposed to be Maya, but now I think about it, White would do that. Just to be petty or some shit. <laughs> White would do that, yeah. <coughs> I, mean, I mean, he's a piece of shit. I mean, there you go, yeah. <laughs> times have changed. Times may change, yet with crime, it's the same old story. In fact, it's gotten worse. Lengthy court proceedings are no longer realistic. I didn't realize you were reading. I thought you were just telling me that straight up. I was like, Oh no! Like, <laughs> it really hasn't is. changed that much, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, no, the, uh, we're not a political channel. I'm sorry, <laughs> but kidding. A few years well, ago, <laughs> <laughs> so, subscribe for more political views. A, a limit of three days was put on initial court trials. Almost all finish in a day. Most of a good guilty verdict. I never thought I would end up in the defendant's chair myself for this case. Mm. <laughs> mm. Imagine, imagine like how he nuts he's like with the true culprit appearing as a star witness this is it tomorrow it's me or him it, it's gonna be him because i'm the fucking protagonist <laughs> yeah. bitch oh we oh we were literally at the end of the chapter and we ended it okay cool well save progress yeah 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gingers. September 9, 952 AM District Court Defendant Lobby number one. You know, I actually completely forgot if I recorded or not, and I actually double checked. I was like, okay, we are. <laughs> Thank fucking God. Yeah, that's why when I slammed the table I was looking carefully at it just in case I accidentally did press a button. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess this is it. Yeah. One way or another, this case getting this case gets decided today. Ah, Phoenix, look! Buzz like an alien! <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> just poker face is so sweaty. He just stands up. <laughs> he just, he's just like... Yeah. You can literally like morph him into a monkey with his face, dude. <laughs> Chang did it with Aisho Speed from that yeah. one meme. <laughs> <laughs> Which kind of does look like I show speed, I'm not gonna lie. That's how one of them Oh my god. But dude, that was a whole straight up violation, that meme. <laughs> dude, I swear to- Oh yeah, dude. Fucking I show speed fans are unhinged. He's unhinged. Oh yeah, he himself, <laughs> but his fuck his fans do not- They don't hold back. They, they're, they're like full in. That's, oh, that's what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Prosecutor Edgeworth. I, oh, that's you. Hey, alright. I received a call from the chief prosecutor's office yesterday. What? I was told whatever Mr. White said today will be the absolute truth. No matter how you try to attack his testimony, yeah. <laughs> if I raise an objection, I have a good faith that the judge will listen to me. I don't know if I'm speaking robotically. <laughs> no, no, you're basically just speaking, norm speaking normally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What does White have to... Wait. What? Does White have the judge in his pocket too? So, you're saying I'm going to be guilty. End of story? I will do anything to get my verdict, Mr. Wright. Anything. <sighs> Why? Why? How can you torment an innocent person like this? Because I have money, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I have something called cold hard cash. <laughs> something you don't have. 
You're in high school, so... <laughs> and a mother. <laughs> Wait, did I say mother? Well, I was gonna say, well, yeah, I guess that makes sense. And a sister. <laughs> I have an actual family. You're an orphan! <laughs> Innocent, how can we know that? The guilty will always lie. Yeah, the guilty will always lie to avoid being found out. Right. There's no way to tell who's guilty and who's innocent. Is that really what he thinks is a prosecutor? I don't think that. All right. Well, it's completely ironic once we get to his story, but yeah. <laughs> uh, all I have to hope to do is every defendant declare guilty. So I'll make it my, that my. I'll, so I'll make that my policy. <laughs> <laughs> it just goes into like a little bit of Ed. Ed what's his name? Uh, what's his name? Eric Cartman. <laughs> I, I had a complete break. This happens so much, I swear to God. In my bed. <laughs> I Edward. just fucking t tongue twisted every time. <laughs> You've changed. Hmm? Phoenix, you know him? Don't expect any special treatment, Phoenix, right? Phoenix? Well, of course. Well, well, uh, I, I don't... Court will be starting soon. Gotta have dyslexia. <laughs> <laughs> so do I. <laughs> what? But wait! Your defense attorney isn't even here yet. They're not. I'll be defending myself. Which honestly is a better idea, cause <laughs> Yeah, but Bridget sure is totally legal. He, he's, he's, he's his he's his literal he's a literal lawyer himself. He, he can at least put up some kind of a fight. So it's yeah. yeah. So we here, but who knows what it, how it is in Japan. <laughs> maybe it's the same no, I don't think it's the same. Every country's different, but I don't know. There might be like some similarities, maybe. The only reason I know is because I watched a uh, YouTuber lawyer. <laughs> That's all I know. <laughs> oh. That's all I know. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Like, I'm just like regurgitating what he said. <laughs> By name of Legal Eagle. <laughs> oh, I've heard about him actually. September 9th, 10 a.m., District Court, courtroom number one. Amaya's just next to me for moral support. Yeah. Although, let's say, it's like kind of weird how uh, mirrored it is. Because it shows that Phoenix is on the right, but we always go to the left. Well, yeah, since I'm the one basically being uh, accused. No, and Edris was on the left. Oh, really? Yeah, it always shows that way. It should be reversed. <laughs> I don't know. Because we're facing the judge. Yeah. To his left should be uh, Edgeworth, and to his right should be Phoenix. His left... Okay, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. to his, to, but to his right is actually us, and to his left is Edgeworth. Yeah. Which is like, why is that way? <laughs> I don't know, but... Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's me. <laughs> yeah, you're so, the judge. Court is now in session for the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright. How the fuck did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> what? Where's your just defending? Uh, where's your just fucking... Uh, what's it, what's it, what's it? I completely forgot. I have fucking dementia. <laughs> I also think I shit my pants. <laughs> uh, the prosecution is ready, Your Honor. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Mr. Wright, are you sure about going up with this? Go, going up? Going up with this? <laughs> yes, Your Honor. I will be defending myself. Understood. Where Mr. Edgeworth, your opening statement, please. As the details in the event are already quite clear to the are already quite clear to the court. I think I just, I just said the Q word. <laughs> <laughs> An accident. Today, we will hear the testimony of the witness to the defendant's crime. I see. The prosecution may call this witness. That went far too smoothly. Why didn't the judge ask Edward why his witness didn't testify before? It's like, it's like he already knows why. Hmm. If anyone's going to raise an objection about this, it's a fo I suppose it's me. Raise the objection and let it go? I'm gonna try it. Mr. Edgeworth, you owe an explanation to the court. Why didn't this witness testify in the trial against Miss Maya Fay? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ever so sorry. Mr. Wright, was a, Mr. Wright was a busy man, besides. At the time, I thought that was what Ms. Ma, Ms. May's opinion on all that could be needed. Would all be needed. Yeah. Again, my sincerest apologies to the court. I appreciate your demeanor. I'm totally not sucking you off under the table. <laughs> Actually, how am I sucking you off under the table <laughs> if you're down there and I'm up here? Oh, right. Whoa. We're, oh, right. We're playing footsie. <laughs> <laughs> Great. You get to show off and I get nowhere. Well, that's 
That's the life of the protagonist. <laughs> I guess so, yeah. I'd like to call Mr. Red White to the stand. Red, Mr. Red, White, and Blue. <laughs> you gotta be, though. Like, I am America! <laughs> you gotta be all those colors in a second. <laughs> <laughs> Please state your full name. <laughs> you wish to know the title of my personage? With these fucking gold uh, rings. Your name? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I was just flexing on all of you poor people. <laughs> yeah. Not that you have any money. <laughs> yes. That I'm letting is... you owe my gold. <laughs> <laughs> I bet all of my money that I will win this case. Yes, that is what I said. Oh dear. Do my locutions confuse? <laughs> Name. <laughs> <laughs> that was the stupidest way I've ever read that in my life. I don't know why I read it like that. Is there a smarter way to read, read that? <laughs> I, I, I guess. I don't know. These two are great together. My name like is... Couple. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Red White, but my friends call me Blanco Nino. And it's Nino, not Nino, because it doesn't have the little squiggly. That's why. <laughs> why? <laughs> Blanco. I see white. I see white, but I don't see red. Like, why would they call you that? <laughs> I have no idea, actually. I am the CEO, or to use a more common term, president of Blue Corp. Did you know the victim is my me, FA? <laughs> that would be a negatory. No, I did not. Careful with that word. <laughs> I, it says right there. I know. <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. <laughs> They know what I'm saying. <laughs> we have to pass. <laughs> the homie said we have to pass, so Ken. <clears throat> Hold on. Yeah. Ah, sorry. You were at the Gatewater Hotel the night of the murder. Uh, how? Correct. Uh, and you witnessed the murder from there? Ahem. Why tell you what you already know? We were almost right. And then you begin your testimony. If I can't rip this guy's testimony apart, I'm done for. Why do I always feel like it's the end of the world and I'm the last man standing? Ho ho ho! I'm still gonna flex all of my gold rings to you <laughs> poor poor! <laughs> I hope you have made your peace with God, Mr. Lo <laughs> Not that I believe in religion! <laughs> I'm too rich for that. <laughs> I'm too rich to believe in... What, what is it you call? Jesus, uh, tr tryst? <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't spell that. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Chris? <laughs> uh, uh, what is it that Sergio said? Obesis? <laughs> Let him have it, Phoenix! What is testimony? Alright. Did for he the... fall from the cross because he was obese? <laughs> <laughs> that man just didn't have the money to hire workers to carry the cross for him. He was poor in itself. Let's see. It was about nine, I believe. I was quietly... Pursuifying air that's reading to you <laughs> some papers by the window. And then I heard a bedlam coming from outside. Surprised, I turned to look at the building across the way. It was then I saw him, a spiky haired man attacking a woman with long hair. Needless to say, that man was none other than you, Mr. Lawyer or Mr. Wrong. I called Miss May over at once. She too was flabbergasted, of course. The victim, she... she ran away, but you, you gave chase. Hey, what? <laughs> Finally, there was a terrible impaction. Then it was all over. Okay, that shit has so many holes. I think I currently say that I'm afraid the defendant is guilty. Very well, defendant. Or, I mean, Mr. Wright. Your cross-examination. Yes, Your Honor. Okay, uh, there's so much shit. All right, hold on. Nine, and if I remember correctly, because it's been a minute, it's been a literal week. Nine is when that one lady ordered some fucking tea or some shit. No, that's when I was coming up, coming up to it. For yeah, he, yeah, because she ordered specifically for nine. Actually, was he even there in the room? That's my question. Let's see, it was about nine. I was quietly pursuifying reading papers at the window. I heard a bed lamp coming from outside. Okay, hold on. Yeah, let me press on that. Bed lamp. 
It must have been when you attacked, I assume. Let me see, continue. Okay, where is the... Hold on, hold on, hold on. By window, you mean the one directly across from Faye and Co. law offices? <laughs> Correct, that is the only window you see. <laughs> and you were reading papers? Correct! The Gatewater is a businessman's hotel, and I am i am a busy man who had business to do. Like flexing on the poor. <laughs> that, that's his entire personality, actually. Flashing, uh, flashing my rings through the window, just blinding people. He, he would be the type of person to actually go to a homeless man and go like, Look at this! No money! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we'll continue. Well, then look at me. They say I'm a rich soul, not a poor soul. Ah. <laughs> uh. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, we'll continue this next time. All right. Yeah. <laughs> For next time, we will...